I just bought a whole bunch of art supplies. Let me show you. All of these supplies cost me roughly $300. I'll show you the price of each item as we go, and then we'll do a total calculation at the end. Now let's start with Prismacolor. If you want to do colored pencil portraits, Prismacolor Premier is going to be the best choice. It came with a sharpener, which I think is really great, and an eraser, which came out to be $42.99. Now let's move on to Windsor and Newton oil paints. So I haven't actually tried these yet, but they're supposed to be really good. And I might as well show you what you'll need in order to start oil painting. You'll need some type of solvent. It's used at the beginning of painting to dilute your oil. I chose Gamsol because it's odorless. I think it's still toxic, so be careful and use it in a ventilated room. This product costs $19.97. Next, I bought some linseed oil, which is a slow drying medium. For a 125 milliliter bottle, it cost $10.96. Let me show you what's in here. It already seems pretty prestigious. I can't wait to try them. Yeah, these look nice, really nice. I'll make a video showing uh, <laughs> my first attempt using them. These came out to be $27.65 with Prime. All right, now let's move on to the Arteza gouache set of 60. It has all of these colors to choose from and they'll most likely last a long time. Let me show you what it looks like on the inside. Ooh, beautiful. Such vibrant colors. Next, we have Artist Row paint pens. These have actually been the best paint pens I have found. The paint runs smoothly and they don't go dry as you're using them. These were $15.99. Next, I'll show you the Speedball Metal Leaf Adhesive at $8.99 and 100 gold metal sheets for $6.59. This is going to be super beautiful for future projects. This stuff is really, really sticky, so watch out. It gets everywhere. It's almost like glitter. Next, Frederick's Canvas Pad. So I actually think that this is the best bang for your buck. It only costs $9.99. It comes with 10 primed canvas sheets and I'm pretty sure you could do some finished work on there too. I would probably gesso with a couple layers first. Let's move on to these 11 by 14 wood panels. These panels are ready to be hung. And last but not least, Phoenix Artist Canvases. These are 10 by 20s and I am super excited because I'm going to use them for acrylic pouring. Now let's do a supply to cost comparison. The total came out to be $245 with 10 cents, not including tax. Tax will vary by state. I really hope this helps. Like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Thanks for watching Art with Bianca. Click on the next video to watch another tutorial.